morning, everybody. Uh, I'll try to make this video as short as possible. Uh, this video is all about how you withdraw your you owns or whatever token from coin store to other exchanges like Luno, Alcoin Trader, or Val, or any other exchange that you are using that is different from coin store. All you need to do, let's say you've already uh, sold your, um, I mean, you already have your thousand you owns and you sold them. And now those uh, uh, thousand you owns, they are in USDT. So in some old time, it means if you go to asset, uh, here it says spot uh, asset USDT, click it. Then it comes to here, then you can say we own. USDT it is, then from there you go to trade. Then let's say on available here, you got a tender owns to USDT. So if they're in USDT, it means you now need to check uh, whatever coin that you have on another exchange like Luno that is here on CoinStore. For Luna people, they can use uh, Ripple or ADA or Litecoin, depending if Litecoin is here on Coin Store and also on Luna. So what I know that the coin that is on Luna and also on Coin Store is Ripple. So meaning if you have USDT here, maybe you got 200 USDT or 100 or whatever amount, all you need to do you can go here on this arrow. Remember this is a laptop on a phone. It might be different. You might have to go to market. So let me just go to market. On market, you search. Remember, you got XRP on Luna. See XRP. So you got XRP USDT. Then you're gonna say trade. Remember, now you have USDT. Have that in mind. So meaning you have USDT, you need to buy XRP. So here is buy. Here you click market. Then here you see all of them. Then you buy XRP. Now you got XRP, you turn your USDT to XRP. Then after that, all you do now you got XRP, you go to withdraw. Remember, withdraw is taking out. So you're gonna go to withdraw, then you choose the coin here, you say XRP, then you click XRP. On your XRP, you say it says withdrawal address. Then you go to your Luno, on Luno, you go to asset or wallet, then you look for deposit, then you search for cryptocurrency, you search for XRP, you will see a withdrawal list. That long characters, you click it here, you, you, you copy it from Luno or Alcoin Trader or Val, then you paste it here, then underneath here it says uh, address tag. Yes, address tag is, is uh, I think it's six numbers. Some they call it deposit tag, then you paste it here, and from there, you click the amount you need to withdraw from a, a coin store to, to Luna or a container or bar. Take note of this. Remember, it says the minimum to withdraw is what? Is, is 40 XRP. So if your, your XRP are not 40, it won't allow you to withdraw. And there's a network fee. So they're charging you what? Three. XRP meaning if you have 40, you click 40 here, only 37 will go to a uh, lunar or country or val. I hope this makes sense. I hope we understand. Same thing applies to let's say you have USDT. Let me go back here. Let's say you have here USDT, but you want to buy Tron. So you're gonna say TRX, then you click trade. Remember, you have USDT now. And uh, then you, you're gonna say buy, you say market, then 100%, then you buy Tron. Then after that, you go to asset, you go to draw. Remember, we draw, you are taking out. So now you're gonna say TRX. Normally, those who use other country than Val, I think they'll use Tron, okay? Uh, or they can use uh, XRP, it's fine, it's up to you. Mara, I'm doing to cover both Tron and XRP. So. Here you select Tron. The best thing about Tron is that it's only uh, one network and the fees are also more the same like XRP. I think in Tron is 
is better because here is around 45 rand and this one is about 3 rand. So we can say and Tron is, I mean, XRP is about 8 rand. So if you trade by 8, by 8, it must be 24. So mini XRP is more expensive than Tron. So I prefer Tron. Maratron, for those who are using Luna, they can use Tron because I don't think there's Tron on Luna. But for those who are using Val and Alcon Trader, they are safe. Those who are using Luna, just use XRP. Yeah. And from then, once you, uh, you have XRP, you go to your uh, Alcon Trader, you copy the address, you paste it here, the amount you enter here. Please always check the minimum to the minimum to is what 215. So meaning if your turn are less than 250, you will not be able to withdraw. If you withdraw, you lose those uh, tron. Meaning you need to have 215 plus the of uh, fees, which is about 245. So I hope you understand. If you don't, please, you can inbox me. But I think I've explained it well and straightforward. I hope you understand. Remember, you have USDT, okay? Once you have USDT, you go to market, uh, you check, Tron, you click Tron, then from there you buy, make sure you market here 100% or you use XRP. I hope you understand and have a, have a fabulous day. I thank you.